So what's up lads and welcome back to another video. So we've just been doing a bit of fishing while we was editing and stuff. Got ourselves to 87, really out of whack with my cooking level, so I decided to do it here. Uh, but for this one, I want to start by getting some points. Because on the high scores, I'm not even in the top 10k. Like, there's madness. Let's get some points, boys. One game of gnome ball later and a flat gnome, and that is the easy Western Province Diary Complete. I've never in my life cooked gnome food. This is f it's fucking torture, but you need it for this diary. All right, that should be the medium diary complete. That is one of the most annoying diaries to get done, but 50 points. All right, give me my reward, little meme child. There we go. And controversially, going to use these lamps on runecrafting because it's actually... Gonna get my uh, me another achievement done at the same time. So if we just do that and that, what level did that get me to? 63, nice. That's uh, base 60s for 100 points as well. All right, should be another easy 50 points. There we go. Gonna try and get ourselves to 20k and then check where we are on the high scores with 19... 460 so this might take a while thank god we saved some of these red dehydes so this should be another task which we haven't done if we wear all three of these there we go 50 points all right world's well, uh, easiest quest complete all right cheeky beginner clue <laughs> the same fucking thing again bro this quest is gonna be so much xp how much was it how much was it 203k got us to 80 smithing that's completely nuts but now we can finish the easy diary all right there we go that is the easy diary finished just got ourselves 79 fletching gonna get ourselves to 80 so we can make a magic short bow and equip it Oh, we should have two tasks coming in here which is make the crossbow so if we just string that uh, is making it a task, yes. And I think wielding it is also a task. Oh, damn, they're both 100 points each. Easy uh, 200 there. Then we just need to get one level, which will take two seconds. There we go, there is 80. And then we fletch this into a short bow. Then we string it. And then there's another 100 points. And then we wear it. There's another 100 points. Damn, I thought that would only be 200. That was all worth 400 points. So we're currently at the Theater of Blood. We're going to do a quest called Taste of Hope, which I've never done because it come out during the time I've been playing RuneScape 3. So it'd be interesting to see the difference between this and... Because obviously the story is finished on RuneScape 3. So it'd be interesting to see like the difference. Can we please get a quest helper like this in RuneScape 3? It's so good. What the hell is wrong with this thing? Oh my god. Getting absolutely flipped on. And there we go. That is the quest complete. The quest actually gives points. I didn't realize. But oh, is that an XP book? It is. All right. I'm going to put this in Runecraft 40k. Uh, it'll give me a couple levels. I know I could be using this on Herblore. But as you've noticed since the last time you saw it, it's gone up two levels. I'm not really having an issue with Herblore. Runecrafting is just, just kind of meh. I know, I know it's fast on here with a recall. But, you know... Just try to get base 70s as quick as I can. So there we go. That's a, a lot of free XP. We're currently... Yeah, we're getting close. We're almost 2k total as well. Holy shit. All right, next vampire quest. Let's go. Jeez, that was intense. I used so much food. And there we go, 100 points. Actually, quite an enjoyable quest. Uh, very similar to two quests in RuneScape 3. They've obviously used the same storyline and some of the same locations. But it's a nice little like different twist to it. Uh, and like different locations for certain things pretty cool and we've got another amazing xp book how much are these though oh my god 240k holy shit that's base 70s right oh my god 100 points for that as well boys and uh i don't know what to do with the rest um I might I might chuck one in hunter even though hunter is annoying but i just want to get it to 75 a bit quicker so i got me to 74 the, yeah one bird house run we'll finish that off and then the last one yeah we'll just chuck chuck that in herbal and there you go almost 80 herbal as well and there we go pickpocket vias these give some weird items like pints of blood i don't know what it does i'm scared to drink it and you get this weird meat but that seems to uh only heal you like five so that's not too bad but these guys they're insane xp it's like 5k a pickpocket yeah 4.9 but they have quite a high fail rate all right let's pet frank 
There we go, 10 points. Well, that's first four completed. This is hella confusing. <laughs> okay, so there's another floor for another 50 points. So there's a task down here to hand in 2,000 of these S at once. But I just kind of kept going. I'm really tempted to just bank 99. I think 99 for me at level 70 uh, is 32k of this S. I've also got 5k normal S as well, which would be... It'd be more smart to use it first because ZMI uh, scales to level. So I was thinking, if, I'm just going to go for 10k at the moment and see how I feel. And then I'm going to go do some room crafting. So there's a task to mine 2,000 of this S and hand it in. I end up mining like 11,000 just because it gives 50% more XP. I think I did the maths to needing 32k of this for 99. But I've got some normal S as well. So I'm going to just use this amount and then we'll, we'll just see how far that gets us. But there's another 50 points. So using this S once, oh my god, that's so much more XP, 8.9k, I was getting like 6k something in inventory, but yeah, that's 50 points for using that S once. Oh, there we go, finally, craft 2,500 runes for 100 points. Well, we've just done 70 to 80, uh, took a little bit of a while, but we've not even touched our the, the green S, we've just been using our normal S, and we've already got that far. So I just realised because I'm over level 75, filling this should be a task, there we go, 100 points. And there is uh, 85 room crafting. I must be out of my mind. So I think the smart move here would be for me to get Aram's robes top and bottom. Because I really want to start looking at doing um, TOB, Fear of Blood. Which is Raids 2 for anyone who doesn't know. And I, you're going to have to pick up the slack. That it's really hard to find someone who has the mage relic to do the mage stuff. So I think I'm definitely going to have to contribute with mage as my second switch at least. So definitely need to get them robes for accuracy and stuff. Oh my god. That is the ultimate double chest. Holy shit. I got Guffin's war spear and Guffin's helm. That means I've got three pieces of Guffin's. Holy shit. We got the uh, the back to back coming in. The Varrox plate skirt. Ooh, uh, Darox legs. Nice. I think these are the legs we already have, though, so nothing new. Oh, there's uh, easy 100 points. Didn't know that was a task. Another big level coming in, just cooking up some food, and got ourselves 95. So we out here learning with a bunch of people who have never completed this dungeon either. Wish me luck, boys. Oh, yeah, we're doing very well, boys. Very well. Whip him up, man. We brought out the big guns for the carry. Man with a siphon inferno cape. Carry me, please. They are enchanted. Wearing them will allow you to meditate on music in order to grow closer to Saradona. Rap was fucking with me, but they just are not my caliber. I pull up and rush you with the G Mall and the Ballister. You go back to Lumbridge, you can't see me, I'm in Falador. This flow is June 6, man. Have you heard of the massacre? Max on my skills, it's 99.99. Free easy payments, rush cause I ain't got no patience. Hospital. GG, boys. GG, though. Well done, well done, well done. Uh, some herbs and some rune ore. So I've come to the conclusion I want to hand in my extra tacits for death costs. Because I'm dying a lot at TOB learning it. And I think I'd rather just not care. Yeah, he'll give me 28.6 mil. That's 120, uh, sorry, 100, 286 deaths I can have at TOB. So uh, yeah, I pretty much counts just set on deaths. And boom, there it is. We've got 28.8, so 288 deaths at TOB stored up if we need them. Let's Absolute go. legend. Alora clutch, clutch like 10% on his own. Oh, yeah. Fucking legend. All right, se second loot. Uh, it's all right. Ooh, 80 herb law. We are moving up. Make a Saradomian brew, 100 points. Third kill, a uh, lot of herbs. Just the, uh, the weird things that happen in RuneScape. <laughs> Yo, one of us just got a uh, a sang staff. Hell yeah! Seeds, please. Nope. All alive at the end. That's what we like to see, boys. Well done. Hell yeah! All right, kill count six. Yes, that's what I need. The seeds. All right, kill count seven. Well done, boys. Well done. Please seeds. 
Oh, palm trees. I need them. I need them for that task. All right, lads. So we managed to get seven kill count, which I'm actually uh, quite surprised with. And we managed to pull this staff as well. Uh, that was the only drop I managed to see uh, in my team. But I've had hella fun. Uh, don't forget to smash a like if you enjoyed. I'm probably going to take a little bit of a break to get some stats up and some gear to make TOB a little bit easier. But if you enjoyed the content, don't forget to drop us with a comment, smash a like, subscribe if you're new, and catch you later.